We've heard the stories of crate diggers striking gold. And while you may be hoping for a similar fate, chances are you won't find any of these gems gathering dust at your local record store. Here are five of the most expensive vinyl records of all time. In 2002, a 1966 acetate pressing of songs that would later show up on the Velvet Underground's debut sold for $155,401 and again for $25,200 when the first buyer didn't pay. In 2013, a copy of Sgt. Pepper's signed by the whole band sold for $290,500 at auction, besting both the estimate of $30,000 and the original retail price of about $4. Before John, Paul, and George were the Beatles, they were the Quarrymen. McCartney owns the only 1958 copy of the group's cover of Buddy Holly's That'll Be the Day, backed with an original called In Spite of All the Danger. Its value is speculated to be $300,000. In 2015, Jack White paid $300,000 for Elvis's first record, a 78 RPM from 1953, long thought to be lost, featuring the King covering two songs from the 30s. Ringo Starr may not be the greatest drummer in the world, or even in the Beatles, but he is responsible for the most expensive vinyl sale ever. His personal copy of the White Album sold last December for an astounding $790,000. 